Welcome to our tech tutorial. Today we're tackling a question that many Xcode users encounter. One of our viewers asks, how can I delete a duplicate scheme from my Xcode scheme list? This issue often arises when working with multiple targets, and it can be a bit confusing. But don't worry, we're here to help you navigate through it. Welcome back to another tech video. Today I'm going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully you find the solution. Now, don't forget to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and you'll hopefully get to the resolution. Now, let's continue on to the video. To delete a duplicate scheme in Xcode, first, open your Xcode project. Make sure you are in the workspace view. Next, navigate to the Scheme Management area. You can find this by clicking on the Scheme drop-down menu located at the top left of the Xcode window. In the Manage Schemes window, you will see a list of all your schemes. Identify the duplicate scheme you want to delete. To delete the duplicate scheme, select it and click the minus button at the bottom of the window. Confirm the deletion when prompted. Finally, click close to exit the Manage Schemes window. Your duplicate scheme has now been successfully removed. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To delete a duplicate scheme in Xcode, click on your target next to the play button, select Manage Schemes, choose the scheme you want to remove, and press Backspace. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. A user encountered duplicate scheme names in Xcode while working in a workspace. This happened after adding a Today extension, which led to auto-generated schemes for both the workspace and the Xcode project. To resolve the issue, the user deleted the Xcode project scheme, which restored normal functionality to the app. This specific duplicate name problem hadn't been widely reported, making this solution particularly useful for others facing similar issues. And that's it guys. I hope this video has helped find that solution that you're looking for. And if it did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. Now, until the next time that you need technical help, I hope you have a good one.